happens. Weather from where you live. Well, we've got another dry, crisp, and cool night across the area, and live Doppler 18 is clear. But if we look at the upper 12 inches of topsoil in our area, the moisture is way below normal. It's powder dry, about 12 inches deep, below normal topsoil moisture over much of the area, especially down here from Lafayette and Arusheville, Tipton, and down towards Crawfordsville, where you've had no rainfall, if any, during the month of September thus far. But if you go way down in the soil, 72 inches, soil moisture is near normal over much of the area and even above normal as you near the state line. So all the rain we had during the spring months and very early summer and also a period of wet weather we had in August is being stored up deep in the soil. And if the trees and plants can get to that moisture, they're doing okay. But the lawns, again, they're shallow rooted. They can't get to that moisture. So they are uh, browning up pretty quickly. But rain's on the way as high pressure moves off to the southeast. Low pressure down in Arkansas will head our way. And these clouds you see down here and the rainfall will overspread the area late in the weekend and especially early next week. But it will be a chilly night tonight. We've already dropped well down into the 50s. We're headed for 40 to 45 overnight tonight. So it's jacket weather at the bus stop tomorrow morning, but warming up very nicely in the afternoon, about 75 to right around 80 degrees with a lot of sunshine. A few high thin cirrus clouds coming up from the south and wind still running out of the east and the northeast. Friday night frenzy looks good, but take the jacket to the football games because temperatures will crash again Tomorrow evening, Saturday looks good for the Purdue game. Sun mixed with some high cirrus clouds. Same thing for Sunday, warm temperatures at 79. But here comes the rain Monday, Tuesday, and a Wednesday. At least periodic rainfall is in the forecast for all three days. And even a few showers lingering into Thursday with highs upper 60s to lower 70s. And another cold front right here will usher in much cooler weather by later on next week. And rainfall, models still cranking out around an inch of rain for much of the area for next week. So tonight, though, 44, a chilly night, though. Clear skies. Tomorrow we warm up rapidly with that dry air, mostly sunny and pleasant. Winds out of the northeast and highs running in the upper 70s. Upper 70s to near 80 over the weekend. But clouds will begin to increase, and then we see at least three and a half.